this is a Tom Anderson guitar, specially specced by the guys here at Five Star Guitar, and it's a wonderful, absolutely wonderful guitar. Uh, it's got this <clears throat> vintage vibe neck going on. Um, it's got the Buzz Featon tuning system, which makes it so it's going to be in tune, especially in the tighter, closer, uh, tighter voice chords up and down the neck. So let's let's just take a listen to that real quick. switch going on and then it's got a coil split you can split the humbuckers by pulling up on the tone control let's see what that sounds like back up to the neck position like a telly there. It's more like a traditional telly. These pickups are kind of like Tom Anderson's version of a PAF. They're called the HC1 and HT2, HC2, and they're supposed to be like PAFs, but a little bit more musical, a little bit more friendly. All right, so going back into humbucker mode, I'm going to take it out to the bridge here. Into, I'm gonna check out, see what the single coils are doing. Because right now, in the bridge position, it feels like a telly, it sounds like a Les Paul. So I'm gonna split the coils and I'm gonna see what the out of phase sound sounds like. <laughs> kind of has this double, uh, this Jekyll Hyde thing going on where it's kind of both realms. It's like Strat sound, Telly sound, and then it's got this really nice fat humbucker sound too going on. I'm still uh, splitting the coils. I'm going to be in the out of phase on the second position here. <laughs> like a strap.
think that's this guitar could make that sound. <laughs> that's pretty fun. <laughs> I'd never give anybody permission to ever get rid of a guitar if you already have one. But if you, if you uh, if you're looking for something that will will do a lot of things, <laughs> this will do that. That's awesome. That's awesome. All right. Well, what does it sound like uh, in the humbucker position there? Okay. <laughs> Italy, it feels like Italy, uh, but it's got the Gibson scale length here. Um, the mahogany neck too, so uh, it, it feels like uh, it feels like a, a Gibson wood. It's got the Fender tones, and then this the the flame on the back of the guitar. It looks like it's mahogany, but it's actually Okumi. And we got the Tom Anderson neck joint, special neck joint where there's more contact between the body and it's a, it's a bolt-on but there's more contact between the body and the neck because of a v-cut uh, and acoustically it sounds it rings a lot more it rings kind of like you'd expect a set neck to ring but it's really loud acoustically too definitely louder than you know, think a, a solid body would be Loving the fact that it's in tune from the, the bottom of the neck to the top of the neck. This is wonderful sounding. It sounds wonderful. It's lots, lots of overtones. I feel like sometimes on the bolt on necks you can really hear where the neck and the body meet and they kind of compete with each other. And that's not what's going on here. It's everything singing, everything. It's, it feels like you can hear the top of the guitar and you can hear the bottom of the guitar here. You can hear the headstock, you can hear the body and they're meeting together. And yeah, there must be something about this joint. <laughs> For sure. Yeah, once again, this guitar was designed by Five Star. It was spec by them. It was their idea to come up with this guitar uh, and yeah, it it looks it looks like a uh, a Gibson uh, top, and it it looks like a, uh, it looks like a Les Paul and a Telly body, but it also kind of has those those Telly tones, but a little bit richer, a little bit richer. I haven't heard anything out of this guitar at all that wasn't just singing and gorgeous. All right, well, 